the best bit I would say I don't know I think the word like if you can call yourself an engineer for me that sounds really cool I hope it's not because it's traditionally like a male thing and so to be a female engineer is unusual I also just like you kind of just know about the world like I can look at a building or I can look at a bus or you know any kind of process or object and just be able to understand how it works for me it's very empowering and I think it's a really exciting thing to be able to do and kind of have that freedom to take your interest and then just apply this kind of way of thinking and way of learning to it um, but yeah I'd say that's probably the best bit <laughs> do it absolutely I mean I'd be slightly hypocritical if I didn't want more more women to do it but um, I think yeah I think it's probably one of the best sort of foundations of like understanding and thinking that you could give yourself for any kind of career you go into you might not do engineering you might not be an engineer when you finish you might find some other kind of interest but all the stuff you learn it's just such an interesting degree and you you know you have it almost as like the default for men to do and like women just I don't know whether they just don't think they can do it but yeah I think absolutely it's a really good one to do and also I think probably the bit that's more of a focus should be not the people the women and girls who are already thinking of a career in engineering it's the ones who aren't it's the ones who it's just not even on their radar because for them I, I hate that thing about being good at maths is uncool um, but I just think that no one can actually be bad at maths it's just rules and methods to follow but um, it's just that you've been taught badly and so I think we need to change the way that people look at those things and no one actually gets over that hurdle of the first difficult bit to see when you can actually apply it and that's when it gets really cool and interesting when it clicks and same with physics and suddenly you're like oh okay that makes sense um, but yeah so focus on them maybe <laughs> yeah I think definitely I think even from a point just a point of view of diversity if you're gonna have an area of industry where you need the maximum amount of like creativity and it's the forefront of innovation and all these things you need as many different types of minds as you can get and I think by cutting you know cutting out women is a drastic thing because you know it's half of our population um, but it you know it also equally extends to race and religion all those kinds of things but I think with women you have in engineering a lot of group projects and I think women can really change those dynamics I think that's like a really good thing to add into groups in that way it needs to be done you know you can look at it from an economic standpoint and in Britain we need more engineers so we need to invite women in but I think it's also changing massively the the area and so it's not all like people think of engineers sometimes as mechanics we don't know what engineering is a lot of people don't and it's just changed it's in everything I think it's a really exciting area to be in and I think it's going to apply it's going to be even more relevant to everyone so I think yeah definitely get more women involved